Hey everybody, I'm Scott, here at Marvel's Kids Museum, bringing you another Marvel's Lego Challenge. And today, I want to show you how to make your very own Lego Jack-O-Lantern. Now my favorite part about Jack-O-Lanterns is you start with a pumpkin that's basically a blank canvas that you can turn into anything you want. And my favorite part about Lego Jack-O-Lanterns is that I don't have to get my hands messy. Now, before we start building, I want to show you what makes all these jack-o'-lantern faces possible. And that is the Lego wing. Most classic Lego bricks are squares or rectangles. But Lego wings introduce all kinds of angles, curves, and complex shapes. It is by using these pieces either individually or by combining a few together that allow me to make all these different pumpkin faces. Let's get building. I'd like to show you how to make a jack-o'-lantern similar to this one here. In order to do so, you're going to need these pieces. Feel free to pause so you can gather these pieces and follow along. Now don't worry if you don't have these exact pieces. Remember, pumpkins come in all colors, shapes, and sizes. So let's get started. First, I'm going to start with a green base plate. It doesn't really matter what size you pick as long as it can fit your jack-o'-lantern. For mine, I'm going to start with this plate here and grab a 6x6 six six orange plate, placing it four studs from the bottom and right in the middle, left to right. Next step, I'm going to add a few green pieces to be the stem. And now we've got our pumpkin. Isn't he gorgeous? It's time to add a face. Let's start with the eyes. To do so, we're going to take the 1x3 flat black plates, put them one stud from the top and just off the center, like so, and one on the other side. Next, take these two single stud blacks, place them at the bottom of the 1x3, leaving a one stud gap between. Finally, take these two 2x2 two two triangle wings, attach them at the top, and we've got our jack-o'-lantern's eyes. And with the eyes done, we can really see our jack-o'-lantern coming together. Now we need to give them a smile. We're going to need these last few pieces here, starting with a 2x2 two two square, right in the middle, one stud off the bottom. Then add these two 1x2s on either side, one stud up from the square. Then the next two 1x2s. Just like so. Again, take those last two little black wings, add them in there, and he's smiling away. And with the mouth done, we've got ourselves one smiley pumpkin. Now you don't have to make your jack-o'-lantern just like this. Remember, you can make it your own. Maybe make it a little sillier, maybe a little spookier. If you need a few extra ideas, I've got a few more faces I made here to inspire you. Remember, you can use individual pieces or combine lots of wings to make any kind of face you can think of. And now it's time to make your own Lego jack-o'-lantern. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Whatever it is, be sure to share your photos and videos with us on social media at Marvel's Kids Museum. And I'll see you next time.